Should you get advanced training beyond your concealed carry class? In this video, we're gonna have a straight up discussion real quick on why you should absolutely get extra training beyond concealed carry. But first, I gotta go out here and check and see if this grass is dry enough out here to cut yet. And, well, This grass is getting tall here on my range, man. I don't think it's going to happen today because, uh, yeah. Yeah, this is, this is way too wet. Damn it. What's up? It's Bishop here for Tactical POV. Thanks for tuning in. Appreciate it so much. Guys, today... I'm going to talk just straight up, no product reviews, no drills, nothing today, okay? Uh, as I said, I was thinking about trying to cut the grass here, but the problem is we've, we've had rain for almost two weeks here. It just literally just rained every single day this past week. Every day it's rained. I think uh, somewhere in there, some, I think we had a slight break Wednesday. But... Um, Neither that, neither, uh, more what to say on this. Yeah, the grass is still wet. It sucks, man. It's getting thick here, and I got to get on top of this cell here. Maybe we'll try it here another couple days. But anyway, like I was saying, what the title is this, should you get advanced training, more training, beyond concealed carry? Absolutely. Absolutely. I agree 100%, 1,000%. I say this all the time. Get more training. Get more training beyond concealed carry. Concealed carry classes will only give you so much knowledge, okay? It is nowhere near enough knowledge that is involved in this entire genre of concealed carry. Everything that's involved is just a smidgen of it. You're just scratching the surface. I even say this with my own, my own course, my own CCW course, which is advanced, okay? And, and it's, it's a little more advanced because it's definitely, it has some more things involved in it than just the average concealed carry course that's taught. I know this for a fact because I used to teach the average concealed carry course for years. And then I changed it because even years ago when I started to teach it, I always thought it was, uh, I always thought it was lame, man. I'm sorry. It, it is. It's just the bare minimum of certain things in it just to get you legal to carry. Okay. Now my course doesn't skip any of the responsibilities as far as knowing what you can and can't do in the state, other things that's involved, legal issues, and some of the stuff that's involved in it too, as far as, and also some NRA stuff that was taught in the class. I took pieces out of it that were relevant and pertained to concealed carry. I added some more stuff to concealed carry and some of the stuff I brought out on the range so you're physically doing it. Because for years, it's just stuff I'm telling you, man, it's just, I'm sorry, it's boring. It is boring. It's boring enough to where you can get people just zone out when you start talking about certain stuff that is really irrelevant and didn't really matter. Okay. I like to keep my students engaged in my course and I took me a while to figure out how to do it. And so I made it a little bit more, more visual. And then on the range, definitely more activity, a little bit on the range. You're getting more knowledge out of it, what I put into it. So you're getting some more out of it than just the average. So, with that being said, even with my course, my course is, it, it's, it's only going to give you a smidgen much, just this much more, just this much. It's not much, okay? Honestly, in pretty much any concealed carry course that's conducted in one day, that is just getting you 50-50. And I sound like a broken record because I promote this all the time, but it's the truth. The knowledge that you get from a concealed carry is just enough knowledge to get you legal to carry. That's it. It's just to give you enough knowledge, just enough to where you can be legally compliant to carry a firearm or a weapon. That's it. That's it. That's as far as it goes. My course, because of some extra advanced stuff that I teach in my concealed course, gets your, it basically gets you just a smidge above 50%. It's just a little bit more than 50. Okay. I would say at the most what I teach is maybe 55 to 45, but still that's, I mean, 50, 50, 55, 45. I mean, hell, that's still a coin flip, man. That is a coin flip on your life. And I'm not a gambling man, but I am the type of person to where I want my eyes to be higher than 50, 50. I don't know about you, but I want mine to be way higher than 50, 50. Okay. Way higher than that. 
I want to be on the extreme high end of my odds of winning a confrontation if it goes down and not screwing up. That's the other thing too. So take an advanced course, absolutely, man. Don't cut yourself short. You are doing yourself a grave injustice of cutting yourself short of getting more knowledge of self-defense. And this is just on the arm side of it too. Get knowledge as well on the unarmed side of it too because that also incorporates itself in with armed defense. Understand, the average distance of engagement, the average distance is roughly 11 feet to three feet. That's the average distance of engagement that if somebody engages you in a, in a violent confrontation or attacks you, that's the distance. That's the average distance, okay? Someone can close a gap on your, basically your seven yard rule or 21 foot rule is your proximity, okay? This is your fight, as we say, your fight or flight proximity around you, 21 feet around you. So it's, that means at some point, somebody steps within 21 feet of distance of you trying to engage you, your mind has to go into either fight or flight. It has to click right now. What do you decide to do? As they get closer, it's going to come into, you're going to have to fight. All right? You're definitely going to have to fight somebody if they engage you from 11 feet to 3 feet. Anything within two arms reach, that's too close. Three feet is closer than that. So, as I'm saying, advanced training. Advanced training unarmed. Advanced training armed. Yes, you need to get this beyond your concealed carry. Don't cut yourself short. If you... If you took a martial arts class one day and it was an eight hour class of martial arts, do you come out of that class and honestly think you're a black belt? <laughs> okay. This is the analogy I'm putting because this pertains to concealed carry as well. It's the same thing. The knowledge that you can learn in an eight hour martial arts class, when you step out of it, do you honestly think you are at black belt level in order to defend yourself unarmed against somebody that's going to violently attack you if they engage you from 11 feet into 3 feet? Do you really think you know enough at that point from an 8 hour martial arts course to being engaged in defending yourself successfully, defending yourself? I bank on absolutely not. You don't know enough. Okay? You're not going to know enough in an 8 hour martial arts class even with an eight hour concealed carry course or 10 hour or 12 hour, you're not going to know enough information because you don't know the drills to practice. You don't know other things that's involved with this to help elevate your skill level. You don't know this stuff yet because it cannot be taught that fast. It can't, okay? It takes eight hours just to squeeze in and try to ram as much as you can in in that time frame to go at least eight hours on a class. Okay, and like I said, it's at least eight hours. So to get eight hours in on that class, I gotta screw, I gotta jam so much information in here in, in the classroom portion of it, then get everybody on the range and then jam even more stuff on the range. It's a mind blowing deal to people who are first time coming out here or first time concealed carriers, okay? That's a lot of information. I look at my students that teach and everything and they look at this and they go like, man, it's like, dude, it's just so much stuff, man. Yes, it's a lot of stuff, but still, life still 50-50, I'm sorry, it is. Okay, you got to get your odds higher than that, higher than 50 50. You got to elevate them as high as you can get them. The only way you can do that is you have to get advanced training beyond concealed carry, beyond the class that gets you legal to carry your tool of self defense, man, your tool of last resort, your firearm or knife, or whatever you carry. Okay, whatever it gets you legal to carry, you have to get more training beyond that. Concealed carry is nowhere near enough, man. It's literally just to get you legal, and that's it. So as I said, for you, for me, I don't know about you, but I know for me is the reason why I train this stuff for years. I've been teaching for years. I've been training this stuff for years. Even the stuff that I developed and put into, into my course to build a, a really, really good advanced handgun course that really zeroes in on concealed carry real life stuff that you need to know. I'm not I don't overload my advanced course with some irrelevant stuff that's not going to really pertain to that. It's really going to pertain to situational awareness, situational stuff that involves you carrying concealed out here in the real world and things that you will have to do, that you will have to do in order to practice and then you take this with you for the rest of your life and you practice stuff, man, and get your eyes up so you can survive. You can survive a violent attack because you know more. You're not going to know enough in concealed carry, not even mine, okay, because I just can't teach you all of that stuff in an eight-hour day everything I can't my advanced course is nine hours okay there's a lot of drills that I'm gonna try to squeeze into nine hours 
and I don't even know if I can do that yet. Still, I got to timestamp these drills, to make sure if I can get them all in. If not, if I got to kick some out or turn that thing into a two-day course. So, but that's that's the thing that I'm coming at you guys with to get you to understand that. Yes, man. Yes, absolutely. Get advanced training. I know you guys who watch my channel. I see. I look at my numbers. I see the demographic that I'm that really tunes into my stuff. Thank you so much, gentlemen. I, I do appreciate it. All of you, all that tune in. This, I'm not singling out just a certain group. Everybody, men, women, guys, share this with your girl, share this with your wife, okay? I, I love teaching women because I, I really do enjoy teaching women how to shoot. I teach, I enjoy teaching them how to understand a firearm, how to manipulate this thing just right, get that fundamentals man and shoot. And, we, and I have fun in my course too because I, I put a little competition thing up with either guys and their girlfriends or something like that or husband and wives you know i have some fun with that stuff too surprisingly women ladies you guys shoot a little bit better than men and that's the truth i've been doing it for years i watch you that's another discussion <laughs> it's another funny discussion too because as i said uh women you you are uh when you get out and do this thing you surprise yourself seriously and it's not just my course just take just take a command course get the knowledge and I say, if you want to come and take my course, I truly appreciate and love to have you. Seriously, there's so much more to learn to this. Get more training, people. I'm going to sound like a broken record for here on out. I know a lot of my focus here lately, it hasn't been so much on concealed carry. I've been focusing a lot more, as I said earlier this year, that I'm focusing a lot more on my business with advanced training because I know there's some people out there that are looking for some place to get more training with the firearm. I'm trying to get this message out to you that yes, I offer it. I offer advanced training and I'm probably less than a handful of people around this area if I'm, if I'm one or two guys around this area actually that has a business model based on this thing for advanced training. Everybody else is concealed carry and that's fine. Get the knowledge, get yourself legal, then come see me, all right? Come see me, take my advanced course. I promise you it's a great course it really is i worked a lot of years to get this thing together and to get it started and uh i'm just dying to teach it man i'm dying to teach it to people to, so you can see exactly what this thing is involved what's about it is so much more so much more get more training i promise you please get more training beyond concealed carry you will you you won't regret it i promise you you won't regret it this stuff that you learn it will change you. It will change you so much. Mindset, skill, everything. It'll show you what you can do and what you can't do. And it's not saying that you can, it's just maybe some things you have to work on, okay? Certain things that you have to work on, work on it. At least you know the drills that'll help you achieve the optimal level of going through that drill and understanding, get yourself like, I used to be here, but man, I, I was bad with it. Now I trained it over and over and over, and boom, I'm right, I'm right on point with this thing, you know? Get the train, guys. Get it. I can't, I can't. As I said, I can't say anymore. I sound like a broken record. I know I do. Get more training, okay? Get more beyond concealed carry. It is worth it. Absolutely 100% worth it. So if you enjoyed this video, guys, I appreciate it. Give it a like. Yeah, subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. You guys who have subscribed, hit that all bell notification too as well. Check out the links for my merchandise because everything such as this here, which I've been wearing, it's kind of it's fading, man, but I've, I've been beating on this shirt though. So get stuff like here with my, my logo, my brand stuff, shirts, everything else like that. Check out my also link too for laser app. Get a discount on that application. That application laser app is just like iTarget Pro, but better, better. I promise you, there is so much more you can do with laser app than iPro. I know iPro is big. There's some other apps out there too that are pretty good, but laser app literally gives you a ton more stuff, a ton more. I'm talking for competition shooting, man, for anything. I mean, there's this laid out steel shooting. I mean, it's just check out that app. Check it out, man. When you get into it, you'll be like, holy crap, I didn't know you could do all this. It does a ton, a ton of stuff. Check into it. My link to the discount to get into that is right here in the description. Check that out as well. Somewhere I'll throw some cards up here. You'll see them up here in the corner here of some other uh, stuff that I can think of that you guys might want to watch. Check out my website. Go there. Check out all my information and everything else like that. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. And as I always say, and it holds true, you are responsible for your own safety.